Hi guys, hope you guys are all having a good Monday. I wanted to do a chit chat video, but I need to I need to touch on something real quick and then I'm gonna get my regular little chit chat video out of the way for the regular people that are over here. <laughs> I, I I worked this morning and it was probably about nine forty five when I got back in my car. I didn't have my phone with me. And um I was coming home and um, service was really like kind of sketchy all day yesterday for me. And I, I get all these messages that are coming on like a message request on Facebook. Um, and like in the last hour, I've gotten even more messages. Um, so I'm, I'm assuming that um, maybe the Craft Chat channel is live right now. And they've got like a chat box or something going on there. Um there are people that are actually in that chat box that are doing screenshots and they are sending them to me over here um, on my Facebook. And I opened up one or two of them probably, probably about 25, 30 minutes ago. And I read one of them where it said, Shannon needs to be locked in a closet. And I thought, wow, really? So when I read that, I was like, I don't even want to read this crap. And of course I deleted it and just went through there and deleted all the other messages from people. I don't even know. I don't even know these people. So, um, it's so funny to me that people, they really have nothing better to do today than to take screenshots and send them over, you know, and then, you know, you hear through all of that, that, that people are being attacked and people are um, going over on these channels and making comments and stuff. And it, it's not happening. It's not happening. You'll never see me go to their channel and go under their video and make any kind of comments to them. I always re react to or respond to comments that are responded to under my videos. So to, to you people, I don't know who you are, so I don't, I can't really give names because I did delete all the messages. Um, don't do that. Don't do that. That is so childish and so juvenile. I don't care what they say about me. They can say whatever they want to say about me. Those words don't affect me like that. Um, I feel really good about every, everything that I've discussed in every video that has to do with anything going on over there. Um, I, I've stood by the truth. I've, I've got facts. And some people just have a hard time hearing that truth sometimes. So you get the childish behavior. You get the, you know, the slide little remarks and the little jabs here and there. I, it doesn't bother me like that. Things like that don't affect me. Um, it's all about getting the truth out there and the awareness out there of what's really going on. And I feel like this, if... If anything that I've said, um, people want to look at it like it's a lie or it's made up or it's assumption. If you're visiting that channel today and you see that stuff going on, um, it's not that hard to figure out. It's really not that hard to figure out. It's clear behavior. If they can take someone like me, I don't care if any of them like me. Honestly, I don't. I'm not losing any sleep about that. If they want to act that way and they want to make comments like that, it's just showing their real character, you know? So don't send screenshots to me of what's going on on Angela's page. Don't send screenshots to me of what's going on with Robin or Ruby or Karen. Um, I don't care. I really don't care. The only time that you will ever hear me say anything is if they come over here that's when i respond and i have that right to respond you're coming over here you're dropping your lame ass words and you are in the wrong place and i'm going to call you out on it and i don't care but for me i don't want to watch their videos i don't want to watch nothing over there that whole channel to me and this is just my opinion and that's the good thing about living in america is we all have our opinions we all have our freedom of speech and all of that it's just a big place for everyone to go to talk shit about people really um it could be so much more 
if they would focus on what's in front of them and they would actually do their crafts. And this is just my opinion from looking at it before, you know, I mean, you want to break out a roll of tin foil and you want to put it on your head and you want to, you want to look like that and you want to make your foolish remarks you know, it could be taken out of context, you know, um, people want to come over here to this channel and they want to correct me with my, my definitions. Um, and it's just so pointless when you really look at it at the end of the day, it's just completely pointless. People are going to talk. People are going to rant. People are going to show their ass. They're going to make their remarks. If it makes them feel that good to sit over there and chew the fat and talk their smack, and dissect videos, and all of that, it's okay. It's really okay, you know? For the people that are over here on this channel for the right reasons, and the people that do know what's going on, and the people that do hear the truth, and they hear it and see it for what it is, you guys are the one that, you know, you guys, you guys are the ones that matter to me. You're the guys, you're the ones that matter to May and Vanessa, and even Michelle. We're here for you guys. <clears throat> We're not here for the drama and the soap opera back and forth crap. You know, um, it's only a response when they come over here. It's only a response when people from over there come over here or on Facebook, you know, sending their screenshots in like, why? Why do y'all want to be that way? You know, you don't know me. You don't know my life. Who cares if Angela said I was a whore? Angela Holt does not know my life. She doesn't know anything about me. And the only thing that I know about her is what she throws out into the universe online. The only thing that I know about her are people that she's hurt and victimized. That's, that's where I'm at with that. I've already discussed Robin. I don't know Robin. I only see what Robin does and how she behaves. And that's her life and her choices. I don't know Ruby. I'm told she's a very talented woman. Um, I don't know anything about her. I just know what she has said to me and what she has done to hurt my friend with the words that she said, you know. Um, Karen is probably the closest one um, that I could say that I I had respect for, you know. Um, I let her onto my, my, my private page on Facebook, and I really thought she was a funny person and just full of life and all of that. Um, and I've watched plenty of her videos in the past. Very, very talented um, paper crafter and all of that. But I don't know what happened to her. Um, and what I see now, I'm just not interested. You know, that's just my opinion. I'm not going to sit here and trash talk them. Each one of those ladies are talented in their own way. Um, Angela is very talented. She just chooses behind the scenes to keep drama going and keeping people divided. You know. Um, yeah, I'm sure it, it really pissed her off with the video that I made on, you know, the subbotting and all of that. It's how I feel and it's where I stand with it. Until you prove me otherwise, that's where I'm at. But they're the ones that choose to take these precious minutes when they get on live instead of showing somebody, you know, something that they can be inspired by. They just show people how they, how they really are and what they want to do and how they want to project themselves. You know what I mean? To each their own in this life. You're not promised the next five minutes. If that's how they want to live their lives and they want to trash talk and bash other people and walk all over people and make them feel better, that's their true character and how they want to live. I'm not like that. I say what's on my mind. I'm very vocal, no filter, but I also have facts to back that up. And if they want to act that way, everything I've said is just is just, you know, it's just making it more true. So I'm still working on art to you other people. Um, people, people, I don't, I really don't know what to call you guys. Um, most of you guys, I call friends. Some of you guys that have just subscribed over here. Um, I'm getting to know some of y'all. Um, subbies to me is kind of a, it's just a generic word. You know, I can call you all friends. Even for the ones that are here that are not real sure of what they're, you know, what's what really what side they're on. In my mind, there is no sides. 
there's never been any sides. It's just the truth, you know, and getting that truth out there. And, but for you guys that are over here that follow me that have nothing to do with crafting, I'm really trying to clear the air, you know, and get back to the, the roots of this channel with the tutorials. And I've been told I don't have talent, um, that, you know, mixed media art is such a thing. It could be for anything. So one person's art might not be something that someone else is into, but for me, art is an internal expression. And if they want to make a jab on that and say, you know, my stuff looks like yard sale stuff. Okay. Well, I didn't ask you to come over here. I didn't ask for your opinion. Um, I'm not over there dissecting your videos and cutting them apart and telling you your work looks shitty. Just focus on what's in front of you. I've said that since what? New Year's? Just focus on what's in front of you and quit all the smack talk to the people that are bringing the crap over. That's, you guys are the ones I'm talking to because you guys are just instigators and it's just so stupid. I have thicker skin than that and I don't want to, I don't want to play into that. But if you come over here, yes, definitely. I'm going to react, you know. So that's kind of where I'm at with it. Just leave it over there because I don't want to see it. I don't want to respond to it. None of that. If they come over here, that's where the response is at. Am I going to venture over there? No. 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 You don't put your nose where it does not go. And my nose does not belong on that channel. Does not belong on that channel. I can say that. I'm not impressed by anything that I see over there or have seen over there. Really. I mean, seriously. You know, aluminum foil hats to block out subliminal messages you're the one giving subliminal messages. So who's going to give you a subliminal message? Doesn't make any sense to me. Honestly, it's a mockery because in my line of work, I have people that actually have to wear helmets and anybody that has special needs children. And I know there's one person that mentioned that they do. It's just making a complete mockery um, out of, you know, people with special needs. And I just hope that there's not a parent out there somewhere on YouTube that comes across that video um, and gets their feelings hurt because it's it would be really sad and heartbreaking. You know, I have so much compassion for people. And when you get people that want to be shitheads and, you know, talk their trash talk, it's really hard to be compassionate to people like that. You know what I mean? That's just my own opinion. So anyhow, I'll let you guys go because I'm going to go in here and stir up that big old crock pot of chili. And um, I want to try to do some baking maybe. I don't know. So, again, another video of response. It is what it is, guys. Maybe one day we'll get back to normal. You know, maybe. There's always hope. Always hope. So, I'm really enjoying the feedback on um, all of the... Uh, the digis that I'm sharing with you guys. So I really appreciate that. Other than that, I'm going to let you guys go. And I hope you guys all have a good Monday. And I will see you guys in the next video. Even to the haters. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a blessed day. And uh, be nice to people. And be nice, to, especially to people that you don't know. Have a good one, guys. Talk to you guys later.